Hi there Fabric Jugglers, it's Babs here from Fiery Phoenix and today I'm going to show you the secret of the strawberry pincushion. Now I remember these pincushions from when I was, was a small child and I had no idea there was anything particularly special about them. Um, I never really understood why there was a baby strawberry hanging off the main piece and if we take these pins out um, I will endeavour to show you the reason. And so this, the, the main body is, is stuffed as you would expect a pincushion to be stuffed with, with sort of normal wadding. But if you feel, actually feel the, um, the strawberry, I'm going to come a bit closer to see if you can hear it. I'm not sure if you can pick that up. But inside the baby stra strawberry is a different type of filling. And the reason we have a different type of filling, and it sounds metallic, so it's probably some shavings, um, is that that acts as a sharpener for your pins. So each time you insert a pin into the baby strawberry, you're actually sharpening the end of it. And the same goes for needles. So whilst the main body of the strawberry is useful for storing the, um, the pins and the needles that you're using in your day-to-day -day projects, the little baby strawberry has a secret all of his own in that he is a very functional sharpening tool for your needles and pins if they ever become blunt. And that is the secret of the strawberry. And I'll be recording another tutorial coming up um, showing you the different types of filling and padding you can use if you create your own pincushion. Uh, but for the time being, I thought I'd just share with you the secret of these little baby strawberries because you may have these at home and not even know what they're for other than there's some sort of little decorative feature. So um, hopefully that has been of use, hopefully you've enjoyed it, and if so, give that a great big thumbs up, share it around with your friends, and I'll see you around next time. Bye for now.